What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Offered Outlaws. And as you can see, version 6.0 came out. I did a video on it, or well, live stream. And uh, this video is going to show you guys how to buy a gun. And <laughs> that sounds so funny. How to buy a gun and do some target practice with it. Uh, and you're basically going to come in here into weapons, go into the weapon, and go to the gun shop. And you're just going to buy whatever gun you feel like. I already bought them. So there's really not much of a need to buy another one, but hey, why not? You can never have enough, right? You can buy multiples of them and have different versions, different scope setups, all types of cool stuff. It's actually really nice. I, think I, I really like that. Uh, so, you know, after you've selected your scope, you've selected your wrap, if you want to put one on there. I, I like to buy a little extra money or a little extra ammo. You're going to come in here to equipment and buy them. I already bought them. You do have a max of 10, just like you have a max of 200 shots. And you're just going to make sure you buy those. And then you're going to come out and go into whatever map you want to. I'm going to go into the stunt park. All right, and once you're out here, you know, go to wherever you want to go shoot at. Uh, I think I want to go set up a target right up here on top of the dunes. And I think I'm also going to set it right by the car. So we're going to hit this little button up here. You can get out of your vehicle. As you can see, the gun's already out. And up here, you can see your targets and the amount of them that you have. So you're just going to click on one. I think we're going to go with the uh, man target here. And you have to be looking at the ground, as you can see. If you look up too high or it's somewhere that you can't place it, then it's going to just show red like you can't place it on a car but you can place it in a car because it doesn't have collisions which i think is oops pretty funny as you can tell i haven't <laughs> quite gotten used to that yet so you can set your shooting distance that you want to make it uh, i think it goes up to like 500 feet which we do not want to set a shooting distance of 500 feet and our car is just slowly sliding away by car you can also set the max shots up to uh, 20 20 shot limit on the target so let's just place that target here and as you can see there's also the option to restore the shooting target so uh, like this the male target here if you shoot it it does break so you can restore it or you can delete it which is just going to remove it we're not going to remove it yet I'll show you guys that here in a moment so let's get over here all right we're way over here now all the way on the other side we're 159 feet away uh, there is some weird texture glitching going on there just don't mind it too much now obviously you can see he sways a lot we're standing up so if you crouch down as you can see he stopped swaying so much he's still swaying a little bit but it's a lot better a lot less sway going on and as you can see up here, you shows you uh, like the the points. I believe that's the points. Yes. No, that's not points. Oh no, that's the uh, limits for it. So there is no uh, shot limit, or well, there's no distance limit. My bad. That's the distance. Duh. <laughs> I'm a little tired. I just streamed for like two hours, and it's one o'clock in the morning. Uh, and the twenty limit shots of course once you shoot at a target or your friend shoot at, a, at the target it'll show the amount of shots you've taken it'll also show the points you've gotten and the man target being broken obviously if you shoot back in that same place you're not going to get any more points so if you want to use these targets in multiplayer i suggest like a one shot limit although you know somebody just continues to shoot at it it's you know that is what it is uh this gun also has three rounds and that's it that's uh you know your sick simple quick tutorial on how to set up a target and have some target practice in off-road outlaws absolutely cool that this update did come out uh some cool stuff i don't know how, i don't know how much the replay value is going to be for this uh, for you know the target practice and stuff it's probably gonna get bored at boring after you know a few weeks or so uh, you know it'd probably be a little boring by then all right so we're back over here we can restore this target 
or we can just remove it. And if you remove it, you, even if it's a fully restored target, you do not get it back, which is kind of a little sad, but hey, you know, it's nothing, not too bad of a, you know, deal there. You can also shoot cars and stuff uh, if you want, but you don't, you can't shoot other players. And uh, yeah, they, I think they plan in the future to add some sort of hunting element to the game. Because they kind of nodded at it in a comment to somebody in, uh, on one of their posts. So that could be a thing in the future. Not there now, though. Just some target practice. Absolutely cool. Hope this helped you guys that uh, were trying to figure out how to like actually place targets or anything like that. So, yep. Enjoy.